Sonic's gallery of pals over the years have steadily accumulated more characters since the character quickly rose to fame in the early 90s. Some of these characters, like Knuckles the Echidna, were big hits that have lasted the test of time, and have remained as one of Sonic's key supporting cast members. But others, like the subject of today's video, Ray the Flying Squirrel, have evaporated into obscurity. But Ray these days is set to make a pretty big comeback, which has inspired us to put together this list. Our Top 10 Ray the Flying Squirrel Shocking Facts. Let's jump in. Number 10, Appearances. Ray has only ever appeared in one game, Sega Sonic the Hedgehog, released in 1993 as a stand up arcade game, which never actually appeared officially on home consoles. Aside from that, he had a cameo in Sonic Generations. According to an interview that previously appeared on the Sonic Central website, Sonic, prior to Sonic Mania, does not know where Ray's whereabouts is, along with a few other Sonic characters that have disappeared over the years Bean the Dynamite, Knack the Weasel, Bark the Polar Bear, Chaos, and Takao. And at number 9, Sega Sonic the Hedgehog. Let's talk a little bit about Sega Sonic here, where Ray made his debut. In the game, Ray along with Mighty the Armadillo, who is like his best pal, are captured by Dr. Eggman on Eggman Island. Eggman plans on executing them until Sonic shows up and sets them free. The trio then decide to work together to escape the island, which Robotnik then destroys. While the game was initially an arcade game, these days you can get yourself a ROM to play at home. And at number 8, Cameos. So how did Ray appear in Sonic Generations? Well, he was on a wanted poster with Mighty the Armadillo that appears in Cityscape, which states that he's been missing since 1993. The character has also made a cameo in different series of Segas. Specifically, Gale Racer, which was the 1994 Sega Saturn version of the game Rad Mobile. He was a keychain that appeared inside of your vehicle, similar to how Sonic appeared in Rad Mobile back in the day. Muddy and Sonic keychains also make an appearance in the game too. Up next at seven, unusual. Ray, along with Mighty the Armadillo, was created by Manabu Kusunoki, who was a notable designer for Sega, and played a big role in establishing the characters for Sega Sonic. When asked about creating both Ray and Mighty, he stated that he wanted to go with unusual animals, since Sonic as a hedgehog was already an unusual choice. In addition to that, Kusunoki was the CG movie director. Director for Sonic Adventure, and he worked on the original character concepts for Knuckles Chaotix. Up next at six, his personality. Since Ray is a pretty obscure character, not much is known about his personality. The comics have embellished him more so, but we'll touch on that in a sec. Based on the Sega Sonic the Hedgehog game and Ray's behavior in it, he tends to be a bit of a comic relief, and also tends to be more fearful than Sonic and Mighty, which could largely be chopped up to the idea that he is younger than the other two. And at number five, pre Super Genesis. The Archie comics are distinguished by an event called the Genesis Wave. It's a phenomenon created by by Eggman to rewrite reality to better fit the user's benefit. Afterwards, a more severe version came to be, known as the Super Genesis Wave. So that means that there's some slight distinctions in the comics, prior and post to the Super Genesis Wave. Anywho, Ray the Squirrel has two variations of his character, the most recent Archie comics version and the pre-Super Genesis Archie version. This pre-Super Genesis Ray went through two outfit changes, initially having red shoes and gloves, but eventually switching up to blue shoes and blue shirt. The events of the comic were similar to the events of Sega Sonic as well. Moving on to number 4, we have Archie Comics. So after reality was altered, Ray and Mighty became an adventuring duo, and were trained under Moss the Sloth, who had been responsible for tutoring many a Sonic character in the ways of speed and meditation. Aside from this, both Ray and Mighty were also no longer members of the Chaotix, although still had friendly ties to the group. So overall, not huge changes. And at number 3, his voice. A bit of a short one at this number. Ray is one of the first characters in the Sonic franchise whose voice was audibly heard. This occurred in Sega Sonic the Hedgehog, along with both Mighty the Armadillo and Sonic himself. Ray's is the one with the most distinction though, and is high pitched and Sounds kind of childish. Check it out. Up next, number two, Sonic Mania Plus. Luckily, Sonic Generations isn't the last of Ray the Flying Squirrel. The character is set to appear alongside his pal Mighty the Armadillo as a playable character in the extended edition of the hit game. Also, fun fact, his character's shoe design is actually from the Archie comics. Speaking of feet, that brings us to our last number on this list, his feet. Ray is the very first character in the Sonic franchise to be depicted with toes on his feet. This can be seen during one of the animations he's in during Sega Sonic the Hedgehog. So make sure you thank Sega for that, because there is a whole lot of fan art out there that focuses on Sonic. Sonic foot fetishes. In addition to this, turns out that Ray's feet are also one of the most interesting things about him, which might be sad. Some of the earliest concept art featuring Ray shows him wearing the same shoes as Mighty, but that eventually changed. All right, there we have it, friends. Are you guys fans of Ray? Are you excited to see the character come back? Or do you think that it's really pointless to reintroduce another Sonic character back into the mix? Let us know your thoughts in those comments below. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe if you dug this video. Also, make sure you check out the playlist that's currently flashing on your screen for more gaming videos and more Sonic ones too. Thanks for watching, guys. Catch you all in the next one.